Freddy. Hey everyone, I'm Marcos and I'm Moxie Boosted, and welcome back to another Pokemon Sword and Shield VGC 2020 video. Now, I have been very inconsistent with YouTube, uh, and that is because I am in college. However, due to the following reason that's going to flash on screen right now, I don't have a job and my school has pretty much closed, so I'm doing online classes, which means I have a ton of time to do YouTube, and this is how I'm going to stay afloat. You know who else needs help staying afloat? My buddy Yoku, who's going to be joining me today. We actually built a... We actually built a really cool Gigantamax Kingler team uh, on his channel. So if you guys, before you watch this video, go ahead, head over to his channel uh, where we actually did the team builder for this video. You can watch that first and you can see how we came up with the concept. But go ahead and say hi, Yoku. Yo, what's up? Henshin and Gogo, baby. What's good, guys? Yoku here. He's got one of those classic PokeTuber intros. <laughs> <laughs> it, you know it's funny? It's from uh, Beautiful Joe and, and a lot of people just don't it? know that. Yeah, Beautiful Joe is like Joe. that old that old Wii title, right? Yeah, well, it, it came out on Wii 2, but it was uh, PS2 and GameCube, but uh, it was an anime before everything. Oh, I dude, I had no idea. Mm -hmm. Like, I heard about it, but I, I know it just never got an American release, because the only reason I know about it is because I'll, like, binge-watch Digi No Gaming at, like, 3 a.m. in the morning. What's Digi No Gaming? You don't know what Digi No Gaming is? Oh, Digi No Gaming, yeah, I know what that is, and he yeah. teaches you about all the characters. <laughs> I thought you said Gigi No Gaming. I was no, like, no, Gigi No Gaming sounds like an anime I've never heard of. <laughs> Alright, but, but yeah, so we're going to be using this team today. Uh, I'll go over the basic gist of it. Uh, basically, it's Assault Vest Kingler. It's the exact set that I used on my guide video. Um, except we're using Crab Hammer over Liquidation since uh, we want the extra power. We're using a uh, pretty, pretty bulky Incineroar spread. It's got Parting Shot, Fake Out, Flare Blitz, and Darkest Lariat, I believe. What's the final move? Darkest Lariat? For Incineroar? Yeah, Darkest yeah. Lariat. Uh, we're using a Howl Manectric, and I love Howl Strats. It's really fun. Lightning Rod is great for supporting the uh, Kingler. Howl will boost the Kingler's attack as well as Manectrics. Not that that matters. Uh, we're running a very, very defensive uh, Ferrothorn because this team does not enjoy facing Gastrodon. Uh, we're running Crit Kiss, and we're running Physical Life Orb Dragapult, which this entire team is just a fun time. And we made it work really well on showdown but i i tend to execute it really poorly on the ladder so we'll just see how this goes uh if you guys do me a favor let's try to reach 100 likes on this video i'd really appreciate that and subscribe for more pokemon content and be sure to check out yoku as well but yeah let's go ahead and let's grab some games man yes hopefully i can actually get games you know i actually i went out and i finally bought a wire to fix my ethernet connection because my ethernet connection was like it, my rats will chew through it my rats are just off camera i would pick one up but they don't like getting picked up that much uh, and they just chew through all my cables. <laughs> really? Yeah. Dude, that sucks. It's like every other week after we play something, but we got our first game. That's a that's a Sea King. Why are we uh, Lightning Rod? Has to be. Yeah, it's got to be Lightning Rod Sea King. Maybe Swift. It gets Swift Swim too, though. Like both abilities work on Rain teams. I definitely um, think it's Lightning Rod because he's got a Gyarados and a Milotic and a Primarina. Hold up, this isn't he's just Rain Team. This is Mono Water. This is just Mono. Ooh, okay, so we're definitely bringing Ferrothorn and Manectric, right? Oh, yeah. Ferrothorn is disgusting against this team. Manectric can put in the work. I still want to use G-Max Kingler. <laughs> I do, too. I mean, the speed control isn't bad. I'm thinking we can just lead off G-Max Kingler and Manectric. We can bring Ferrothorn in the back. And probably don't want Incineroar, to be honest. Do you think uh, Togekiss? I could see Togekiss doing so. Yeah, because follow me. Yeah, we follow can definitely me. Use that. It's going to be really nice. And... We do have, like, max darkness and stuff to lower special defense, and then Manextra can go in, but, yeah, I, I think that's just a very clear option. I'm hoping it's not Lightning Rod's, uh, Lightning Rod Sea King. I always want to call it Kingler or Seedra. It's neither of those. It's the mixture. <laughs> it's Kingler. Or, no, I, I it's not Kingler. I kind of want to see it to be it's Lightning sea Rod, King. though. Just, just a little bit. I just want to see it. Yeah, I just want to see it, you know? Because I haven't seen Sea King at all in the game. So, the fact that someone's bringing Sea King is ridiculous. Yeah, I'm mostly just, like, concerned that Sea King is going to keep Manectric from doing anything this entire game. Like, for all I know, this guy is, like, a top 100 player, and he's just really, really good at hiding it. And we have matching card numbers. Obviously, he's good then. No, I feel like he's going to just, like, switch in Seedra at, like, the perfect... Not Seedra. I can't remember the name. Sea King. <laughs> he's going to switch in Sea King every single time. I don't expect him to. All right, yeah, that's Oof, Lightning Rod. Oh, yeah, it's Lightning Rod. That's hella Easy. Lightning Rod. Damn it. Okay, you know what? Technically, wait. We can either for I ooh, okay, so I think we should go for how. 
and then hit the uh hit the king drift because i don't really think gyarados can do anything to us unless it power whips yeah uh, and um max foam burst will lower the speed of everything on the field anyway so like and at plus one we're still doing major damage yeah but the reason i say hit the uh the i said king too damn it uh the sea king the reason we should hit the sea king is because we want to get rid of lightning rod uh, he could max Quake though. He could max Quake our Manectric, but we do have the Sash. Yeah, I don't see it. Um, I don't see it being too big of an issue. We'll just howl up and get big damage. I just want him to switch into Water Absorb Seismitoad, and I know he won't. Nah, that's Swift Swim. There's no way he's running is Water that, Absorb Seismitoad. Is that your character? His entire team is just water resistant. There's no way he's running that. I mean, he could. He could. He didn't Dynamax. He didn't. So, or maybe it's just a really slow Gyarados. <laughs> or he wants to land a raw Power Whip. That's gonna do like two. I hope it does too. It's just a That's slow a Gyarados. Really slow Gyarados. Or maybe it's C it's Sea King. It's gonna be Sea King, watch. It better not be Sea King, dude. Is that what we get? No, okay, okay yeah. No, it's, it's just Gyarados. a really Ooh. slow Gyarados. Cause we're dude, we don't even have that much speed investment. No, we don't. We have just enough to outspeed it at minus one. Or at minus two. Alright, howl strats. Let's see how this goes. <laughs> Yo, can we kill Sinking one hit, please? Probably not. <laughs> We're going to do a ton. All right, max foam burst. All right, that did like half. If we howl again, then we're KOing it next turn. By the way, guys, rental code for this team is going to be in the description down below for those of you. Because I know a lot of you guys really want to try out the rentals. Max you airstream. Oh, that's a really team. nice speed boost you got going there, bud. <laughs> Too bad. He's like, no, my speed. How dare you? Dude. It's okay, though. And the thing is, like, regardless of what he goes for, mud shot? Okay. I can't miss Howl, dude. <laughs> yeah, we got that. We don't even do I was going to say, oh, wait, no, that lowered our speed. Drop. Oh, I don't know why. I thought it was the other move. All right, I'm I mean, just going to foam burst. Okay, though. Yeah, we just foam burst and Howl again. Like, what is he going to do? I really want to see Water Absorb. He's not going to bring it, but I definitely wanted to see Water Absorb Seismito make a make a comeback. Yeah. And the thing is, like, even though Gyarados can go for Power Whip here and probably knock us out, if he, do if he doesn't have Power Whip, which I've seen it once in a while for people who want to run Taunt, uh, if he doesn't have Power Whip, then we just KO it with Volt Switch next turn. Oh, you're right. And he's also nice. super slow. Like, he's not doing if anything. If he doesn't attack it, I think he should attack Manetric this turn, but he probably won't. Uh, yeah, there it is. Yeah, okay, he's not going to do it. Okay, so yeah, my Netrix actually can, it can kill Gyarados' turn. Hopefully that isn't... Ah, oh, never mind, I lied. That's going to kill us. Ew. Oh, yeah. No, it's going to kill. But um, we still have our focus set. No, we don't. We have a uh, Volt Switch, but we're at minus one speed. So if anything comes out that's faster than us, we're, we're kind of in trouble. But uh, the main thing that we dealt with here was Gyarados, and that's what matters. So I'm thinking what I want to do here is just get Manectric out depending on what comes in. If like if whatever comes in isn't faster than Manectric, then I'm fine. But also, follow me, Tokus. <laughs> We're Volt switching. Oof. Oof, we got this. All right, what's coming out? Seismitoad? Yeah, we're Volt switching. Yeah, we're definitely doing that. You can follow me out of here. Tokus is going to take a ton of damage, but that thing's so slow now. I feel like Seismitoad is going to go for a ground move. So uh, Tokus should be okay. Yeah, Tokus is probably... I mean, it's not going to enjoy taking the max airstream or anything, but we're still going to be faster than Gyarados because it's at minus three at this point because we landed two firm, uh, foam bursts. Mm hmm. And then Ferrothorn's in the back. Yeah, Ferrothorn's our win con pretty much because we got Power Whip on that bad boy. Volt Switch, we're still faster than Seismitoad. That's awesome. Oof. That does so much Are you damage. weakness policy, dude? What? Oh, okay, wait. Togekiss might be dead. Togekiss is definitely dead. If Luck, he airstreams, but, uh, I don't think we die, but, yeah, but you know, he's at plus two, we might die. I think we're fine, because regardless, uh, Seismitoad goes first here. We, You know, we should have guessed that, considering how slow that Gyarados is. I would not have guessed that at all, to be honest. Is Did he just rock, rock fall? fall? Yeah, we're dead. He knew. He, he knew the play. Yeah. All right, so here's the thing. He's going to... If he's smart... He's going to protect his Gyarados here and uh, go for the ground move. So I'm just going to hope he's not Rindo Berry. Go and I'm going to... Yeah, I'm going to protect and go for Power Whip. Well, he can't... I think protecting on Ministry is better anyway. Yeah. Because um, he can't really kill us yet. 
and we're we're faster because the the sand's out so we're not at minus one speed anymore so we're faster than metric or than seismitoad so if he protects his gyarados this turn we can kill it oh wait we don't even have protect on this thing oof all right i forgot uh, <laughs> we have to well. we have to volt switch on the freaking <laughs> we have to volt switch on the gyarados nobody just doesn't have protect Risk in the biscuit tell me you don't protect on gyarados just switch out bro just switch out let him switch out man just yeah just, uh, that's, that's it he's gonna it, switch you know? it's easy or who, who knows maybe he'll miss earth power <laughs> we got bright powder <laughs> oh, we don't that would have been so nice if we did and it worked oh okay oh, oh. thank you for the gyarados i guess oh okay yes. thank you for gyarados you those. dude we can howl we can howl and then if, it depends what comes out if it's like um if it's Ludicolo, we already won. Unless it's like Focus Blast. But if Does it's Ludicolo um, get Focus Blast this shit? It should get Focus Blast, I'm pretty sure. That's disgusting. Yeah. It it had it last gen, but like no one ever ran it. I don't see it helping with uh Ludicolo being a Dynamax Pokemon now. Yeah. Oh it's pre Yeah, we okay. got this. I yeah, I was gonna say I think we can take this. Um do I risk the Rindo Berry? Or do I, eh, like, here's here's my thought process. Do I just go for Howl and start throwing out Power Whips? Or do I Volt Switch on Primarina? Uh, well, he doesn't have Weakness Power. I want to say Volt, because Power Whip would do enough damage anyway. And if yeah. he doesn't have Window Berry, he's dead. I'm thinking, oh, yeah, because we have Grassy Terrain up. We're fine. Yeah, I so forgot. I would say get as much yeah, damage. Oh, never mind. He just Sick. quit. <laughs> we take those. Howl Strats. He didn't even get to see the Howl. Oh, wait, yes, he did. Yes, he did. Yeah, turn, turn one, one he Howl. Saw that howl strat. I'm surprised he didn't just go for max overgrowth first. I mean, that makes sense considering, you know, we're max Kingler. And people would obviously assume max Kingler if they see a Kingler in preview. But, like, I don't know. I feel like it was always his best play to just go for uh, max overgrowth first. I guess he didn't want to do that because he didn't want to get a... Uh, he didn't have his weakness policy up. So maybe he was more bulk, less, uh, less uh, offensive. Yeah. I I'm thinking, like, he was just... Bulk with enough speed to outspeed Dragapult at like plus two. Like that's how I, I would if, if I were to go with weakness policy Gyarados, that's what I would do. I could see that being a thing for sure. Alright. That was a nice little game, um, a nice little introduction. We got another rain team? Jeez. Why are we facing rain so much today? Alright, so Minectric just goes hard in this game. Like Sash Minectric is disgusting here. Yeah. Uh I'm how thinking... are we gonna deal with that uh I guess EG Slash with Dragapult, maybe? Or no, Incineroar, Incineroar. Yeah, Incineroar. so I think we can lead off Incineroar Kingler, bring Manectric in the back to switch in as Boltbeak, uh, yeah. as Boltbeak goes out. And like, we, we still mess things up with Ferrothorn, to be honest. Yeah, I like this here, especially with the Barrow Scooter there. I definitely like that. Yeah, and even even though like, Incineroar's are, are check to, um, to Aegislash, even if Incineroar goes down to rain, like, it, Aegislash doesn't do anything to Kingler if it's, like, physical Aegislash. And even if it's special Aegislash, we're Salt Vest, so we eat the hits. I'm a fan of this. This this Kingler team, I know people might have thought we did it as a joke. Because it, it was just there, and we really wanted to play with Kingler. Yeah. But, but like, I like what we came up with. It, it, it was just, it, it was, like, serendipity that we came up with something that works. <laughs> yes. It's like, hey, Kingler's funny looking. Let's use it. Hey, Kingler's good. What the hell? I hate the way his Gigantamax looks, but it's so good. Yeah, it just looks like it hasn't shaved. Mm -hmm. Is the uh, is it fifty percent? So it's, it drops it by two stages, right? Or is yeah. it three stages? It, it's, two it's two stages, stages. so it's just, it okay, cuts okay, it in okay, half okay. every time. Beautiful. And my girlfriend just texted me. <laughs> Ooh, a girlfriend? You Why? Cooties, I feel bad because she had to go. She she had to leave college because her parents are freaked out right now because of mm -hmm. you know because of the thing that we're not allowed to talk about on YouTube. <laughs> Wait, we're not allowed to talk about that? It's just not smart, too. Oh. Like, you can get demonetized so quick. Mama Swine and Ludicolo. He's going to Dynamax Ludicolo. All right. Um. Yeah, he's just going to Dynamax. And we can just KO Mama Swine right the hell now. I'm yeah. going to go for Max Foam Burst into Mama Swine, hoping it's not Sash. Do you want to... I think I just go hard in the next trick here. Nah, I want to go hard Manectric, because I don't think he goes for Earthquake ever. He might even just switch out Mamoswine. The reason I want to go hard Manectric is because we're going to outspeed Ludicolo at minus at minus two, even if he has the rain up. Mm -hmm. And he should always go for the grass move anyways. 
So by going Hardman Extric here, I can uh, Volt Switch on Ludicolo or just go for Howl or whatever. Okay. And there's okay. no way he knocks me out either because Focus Sash. And, and just imagine, like, the reality where this guy just ignored Kingler. Like, you if, know, honestly, he probably... I don't think a lot of people... They do the same thing with, uh... I mean, ha people should know Hatterene's threats by now, but... Oh, yeah. G-Max Smite's disgusting. Just, yes. They just ignore it, though. They'll see something else, like a Dragapult in the field. Like, I'm gonna attack Dragapult. I'm like, no. <laughs> that's not the threat here. <laughs> it like, is this Hattery. <laughs> you should kill the Hattery. It's like, you guys are really, really not thinking this through. <laughs> it's beautiful, though, because I get my confusions off. And they're like, oh, man. Then people just rage quit. I... Trust me, I hate hacks as much as the next guy. Mm -hmm. But if I'm the one using hacks, I don't hate it. It's funny that Mudsdale with own tempo was optimal now instead of uh, instead of inner focus. I hate Mudsdale no matter what ability it has. All right, yeah, we're good. Dang, he knew. You think he doubled into Manectric? There's no way. We should tank this. Okay. Hell yes, yeah. Kingler, yes. Hell yeah, dude. He didn't even set up the rain. He doesn't care. Yep. Can we get some heals? I think we can take another one. Um, we, If we Eerie Impulse, yeah. I'm hoping he's not Focus Sash, because then we get the free Eerie Impulse off. Oh, he's not Focus nice. Sash. Nice. I'm going to Eerie Impulse this guy and live the next one, because we're getting heals. Yeah, because he's not going to... I don't think he's ever going to set up... This, uh, I mean, it doesn't matter now. If he sets up rain, he's still going to be slower. Yeah. And we just get stronger. Ooh, this is actually going to be a really close live. Dude, Manetric is such a... Cl I know we... <laughs> we keep doing these as a joke, but Manetric is clutch, and I love it. Hold up. Do I want to get rid of... Um, do Pelipper? I want to get rid of Ludicolo, or do I want to get rid of um, Pelipper? Uh... Okay, so what's the play? If we Eerie Impulse the Ludicolo, we live another hit. Oh, but we're still slow. Wait, no. Oh, we're not max speed. Yeah, this is max speed Ludicolo, so we'd have to Eerie Impulse. I don't even know if we live the next hit. It's it's really close, because it's only minus one, technically. I mean, we still win with Ferrothorn regardless, I think. Um, here, Here's what I think. I think we just let Kingler go down, and we Volt Switch on Pelipper, because we might need... No, we, we won't need Ludicolo. Or we won't need Manectric. Yeah, I, I think we're good. Just trying this out. Okay. I'm I'm gonna Darkness. This is close. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm not even gonna bother with the with the Ludicolo because uh, Ferrothorn beats it anyways. I want to get rid of uh, the... I want to get rid of this thing. Pelipper. Sash, Pelipper? Okay. So we get out of there now. I had to make up my mind really quick. We don't have as much time as we did on Showdown. <laughs> All right, and so I'm gonna get him here. Ferrothorn. The reason I'm keeping Manectric alive is because if there's a, if there's a Drake Assault in the back, we just shut it down. Oh, you're right. There's a Scald. Yeah. No burns. No burns. No burns. All right. Oh, that sucks. Come on. That really sucks, man. <laughs> oh, we are. What the hell? We are faster. Idioka, this now. man isn't running max speed. On He's his, not. on his Ludicolo. You think we should have? Oh well, no, we shouldn't have. All right, looks like we post. lost Yoku. He's no longer in this call. <laughs> I can't hear him. Wait, really? I, I'm gonna have to happened? solo commentary this until he gets back. Where? No, I'm right here. Let me try calling him again. Hello? There we go. All right, I lost you what for happened? that. <laughs> I don't know. I, I lost you for a minute. Could you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you. Yeah. All right. There we go. I have you again now. Bet, 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 bet. Y you heard my thought process though, right? Yes. Wait, what, which part didn't you hear me talking about? I As soon as I said sorry, I had to go through with that really quick. Uh, that's when I lost you. Oh, no. I was saying that the timer goes down so fast in this game. Yeah. Um, so here's the thing. He has to lock himself into something that isn't Bolt Beak if he wants to win. Do you think he's choiced? I'm concerned he might be. I'm gonna go... I think I wanna Volt Switch on the Ludicolo. And just go hard and Cinnaroar for the Fake Out next turn. Okay. And then I'll just Leech Seed into the Dragazole. This Drake is gonna be a close one, yeah. but I think we have, to, we have to win through Timer. We might be able to just whittle him down too, depending on what he can do. Yeah, what annoys me though mm -hmm. is the burn. 
burn really yeah, messed with me. I'm, I'm really upset about that. Not yeah. only was it rain boosted, but he still got that burn on us. I'm thinking if anything, he's Life Orb Drake Azult. Yeah, that, that tells me Life Orb. The fact that he just didn't. Go they didn't ask you. Yeah. Alright. So I get my Intimidate off. If he went for a Bolt Beak, he has the big dumb juice, dude. I don't think he went for Bolt Beak. I, I can see the Dragon move. Or uh, low kick. Does it even? get high horsepower? It gets high horsepower, but or it, stomping it, tantrum, one of the two. It's high horsepower that people run, but it could also have low kick, which I'm concerned about. So I wanted to go for the attack drop. Aerial Ace. Aerial Ace. All right, weird. we're good. <laughs> yeah, we're very weird. Ooh. If I land this uh, leech seed, we we just win. Yeah, he's life Kaiser. Yeah, up there it is. Dang, I was hoping that you could throw Incineroar back into uh, back into the field. Get another intimidate drop off. That's what I was hoping for. Yeah. Let me. If I land this leech seed, we're Gucci. All nice. right. Cool. We got all the recovery we need. Uh, there's no way this thing one v ones. Ferrothorn at minus one attack. So do you want to area impulse the Ludicolo, or do you want damage on it with the the Volt Switch? Um. Because I don't. I don't think Ferrothorn beats it while we're burned anymore. It, it should with the leftovers and the and the leech seed, and he's taking recoil every time we hit him, so we can protect him between each turn. I think mm -hmm. Ludicolo is our main issue now. Okay, so we'll switch on the Ludicolo. Yeah, because our gyro balls aren't doing any damage; it's already resisted. Yep. And he's at like minus two. <laughs> he's at minus two speed. <laughs> How much damage have we even done? Like no damage. Nah, right. I mean he was Dynamax though. Yeah, um, I'm just gonna go for Power Whip. It's stronger against Ludicola. I'm not even gonna protect this turn. Yeah, because he can't kill Ludicola or Ferrothorn. He can't kill Ferrothorn. Yeah. What items does Ludicola have? I it's probably Assault Vest to be honest. That looks like Assault Vest damage. Bolt Beak. Why would he? <laughs> you know what? Oh, he thought. <laughs> you know what? <laughs> just let it happen. Scald, tell me. All right, all right, that's fine. I was gonna I say was, I was actually hoping he went for Ferrothorn. Yeah, because then he it thought he'd wouldn't go even first. matter. Maybe he all thought right. he was gonna go first. All right, we Ooh. we need grassy terrain to run out soon. Um, but how many? If it what? I can't use my words. We have to check how many turns of grassy terrain are left. Because if there's one turn left, or if this was the last turn, uh, we don't get healed at the end of the next turn, I believe. So we always protect next turn, and then we power up on the following turn. Why? Uh, the reason being because uh, we avoid damage from Drake Assault while lowering its health a bit. And then we'd be able to knock out Ludicolo. But uh, I wouldn't want to go for... I wouldn't want to just attack this turn if Grassy Terrain continued the next turn. Alright, this is the last turn of Grassy Terrain. So we protect here. I can actually explain it now. I was I was hurrying. So the reason I'm protecting here is because Drake Azult has to attack. Uh, it's mm -hmm. not going to get any damage off. All that happens is Drake Azult gives us health. We lose nothing from this turn because Ludicolo doesn't even regain health. Okay, okay. So why do oh, you want to power never mind, they regain health. terrain was up? <laughs> never mind, they regain health. Um, <laughs> I wanted Grassy Terrain to go away because I was pretty confident we could knock out Ludicolo with like two more or with like one more power whip, even though the grassy terrain's gone, considering how much damage he did. But now mm -hmm. I'm I'm realizing that <laughs> that's not the truth. I think if you would have power with that turn, Ludicolo would have been dead. Yeah. And then Drake is old. Yeah, you could have protected on that following turn. True. That was a misplay by me. My bad. <laughs> all right. Crazy. Now we got to land a power whip, and then next turn we can go for Jarrow Ball. Because I'm pretty sure we're gonna get it in range for Jarrow Ball KOs anyways, even though it's at like minus two speed. Now don't we quad resist bolt beat? Uh no, it's just it's just one times resist. But it's at minus one and he's taking helmet damage or he's taking iron barbs damage. Yeah. So we can stall out the Drake Assault. He's definitely playing the timer now. But if he's assault vest Ludicolo, then we just win. We have to click our moves as soon as possible though. <laughs> Man, this is ridiculous. I I is he really gonna do this? He's going for timer. He's really going for timer here. His rank is not that important. That's what does it. There's so much damage. Iron barbs. 
We gotta land this. Ice beam. Oh, it's, at least it's good that we can't get frozen. Yeah. All right, we land the power whip. Yes. I think he's in. He should be in gyro ball range next turn. Oh, I don't know if goodness. I trust that actually. Oh my goodness. I'm not sure if I trust that. And the issue is we have to protect next turn. Yeah, to get that HP back. All right. I think Dragazult dies if it attacks us. I think it'll live one more time. Well, no, because... Um, maybe after the Protect, it won't live. Yeah, after the Protect, we'll protect right here. the Leech Seed, um, plus the Iron Barbs. Like, if it hit the next time it hits us, it's going down. Because this turn is taking the Leech Seed, then it's going to take Iron Barbs and Leech Seed. Mm-hmm. So, 100% we Protect here. We might be able to pull this off. It, it's close. It's really close. What's I the think... timer on? Did you happen to catch it? Um... No, I didn't, but it'll tell us when there are, when there's like three minutes left. Timer got increased for this season, so we should be okay. It's 20 minutes now, right? Yeah, it's definitely, it has not been 20 minutes in this game. We're no, good. definitely not. It hasn't even been close. I think we're like 15 minutes in, at most. Well, no, because we're 26 minutes into this video. And we've already had one battle, so there's no way we're even that close. Yeah, we're good. We just have to like not get crit. You get some really nice rolls. I, I don't know. Do we risk the power whip or do we go for the, the go gyro? For the uh, I mean, so he is at minus two speed, so I don't think gyro would do as much damage. Yeah, it's just his health is so low and we're burned. It's it's so close. Because Draco dies no matter what. Yeah. But and I think we can still live a hit. So I think if, if we kill, I think we should go for power whip because if we if we hit Ludicolo, he's dead. Yeah, 80% 80, 80 chance to win or 85 yeah, and then Draco dies no matter what. He clicked his move so quick. He, he, yeah, he's like, I'm confident. Oh, oh are you God, kidding are me? Are you kidding? Wow. Okay, we had that game. We had what? that, that game. Was, oh, my gosh. That was so I, annoying. This is why I hate Pokemon. This Dude. is and See, he died. This is why I hate Pokemon, because the unfortunate always happens when it's not supposed to happen. And right now, that guy is clapping in his chair. He's excited. Oh, my God. I want to say a gamer word. Come on, <laughs> I want to say a gamer word. <laughs> Dude, um, I, I don't really mind it too much, to be honest. Let's let's look at Ludicolo. It was definitely a salt vest. Yeah, yeah. that was a salt vest. I, I don't mind it too much. This is why we played best of three in tournaments. We would have won that. Yeah. Ah, that sucks. Oh, my ranking. <laughs> I didn't really care too much to begin with. I'm eventually going to start a serious ranking series. Yeah? Yeah. How how was uh how does that even work? You know, so because you're gonna be testing teams and stuff, are you gonna just stop testing teams? Yeah, I I mean I'm just gonna like test teams on Showdown, then bring them to my series when I feel comfortable. Mm, gotcha, I got you. Yeah. So what do we got? We have more Peko. Ooh, we got a Venusaur. All right. So Manectric is still really good here. We have to be really careful if we want to use Kingler though. Yeah, because I think that's gonna be a. Why does that look like Mega Venusaur? It just they updated the sprite this game and it looks so nice. Uh, Do you think this is a Togekiss game? May uh, no. I, I he mean, sees Kingler. He sees Manectric. He sees Ferrothorn. I don't. Uh, but then, well, I mean, we can lead like Manectric Togekiss and just start going for crit max airstreams and everything. Yeah. I mean, I feel comfortable with that. The only thing that I'm worried about is if he leads Venusaur, Whimsicott. He gets yeah. up the sun, and then Venusaur starts spamming sleep powders. We could bring a uh, Ferrothorn in the back for that. Okay. So like on so, yeah, that, I think. Or you know what? Wait, 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 wait. I think we should lead Togekiss in Cinnaroar. We'll go with that. Yeah. Because then we like get it. Fake Out. So if he does go for sleep powder, it won't hit, and then potentially crit Airstream would kill him. Yeah, and the Manectric and Ferrothorn. Yes. All right. That's all for the best here. This game's all about leads. All right, what you got, Yuki? Yucky? We're gonna call him Yucky. We're we're trash Yucky, talking, that's, man. That's their name. Oof. We're trash talking, Yucky. Disrespect, Yucky. If you happen to see this, just uh, just know it wasn't personal. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, bro. Just you gotta lose. That's it. Oh, Togekiss and Whimsicott. Gross. That's actually. 
That's kind of a free fake out airstream if he doesn't have protect. I, I think I want to go for that fake out airstream. Yeah, I like it. You want to do it on straight on the Whimsicott? Yep. Like, cause what's a switch in? More Peko? No. <laughs> He's gonna throw in that Venusaur. He's gonna let us kill it for free. Yeah, and even if he goes for um. Yeah, even if he goes for the follow me with his Togekiss, there's a chance we crit and just didn't like just destroy that thing. <laughs> Yeah, I like that play. I don't really see much wrong with it. You know what would be amazing? If you just switched into Venusaur right now. Just switch Whimsicott for Venusaur. Give it to us. That's what I'm saying. Just give us Venusaur, dude. Yeah. Just you don't need Whimsicott right now. Save it for the back. You're like, bro, my birthday's in four months. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> what are you going to do for your birthday? I'm going to kill Venusaur. You didn't switch? Nah. We were asking for too much there. Yeah, series. What is it? Series four. Series five actually will be here in four months. Ooh. Mm -hmm. Series five. That's, that's oh, in uh, the DLC is in June. Armor. Yeah. Now we're playing with some new mods then. I don't know who you're excited for. Like, who do you who do you want to come back? I already know Hodge my like, top and bottom line. Hodge is gonna be disgusting. Is it coming back in Isle of Armor? I'm hoping it is, dude. Like, Hodge has got in base armor, and that's all I want. Dude, it's got like base 125 HP. Ew. Yeah, so if you Dynamax that thing, it's disgusting. You run like a Salt Vest Honch Crow. It, it's got super lucky. You run Crit Honch Crow. <laughs> Ew. I'm not your friend right now. And then they get <laughs> stabbed dark instead of fairy. Yeah, I'm not your friend right now. Ah, Whimsicott beautiful. really just protected itself. As yeah, if I that's, wasn't going to hit you with this airstream anyway. That's common. He's going to go for like Tailwind next turn, if anything. Mm -hmm. Which I don't care, dude. I'm hoping that this guy's like Babiri Kiss. Because then we can just parting shot on it. What if he didn't max airstream? Please tell me you max starfall. No, okay. Dang. I was gonna say, let me get the free one. That's crit kiss. Yeah, that's definitely a crit. Okay. And you want to try and crit him back? Um, I mean it's not it's not worth going for the crit here, because he's always gonna get the tailwind off and go first and KO us anyways. Yeah. I think. So you want a parting shot out? I'm thinking we just flare blitz and whimsicott and get the free kill and just dip. We can max okay. guard too. Because I don't want to risk losing Kiss this early. We could use it defensively later on. Yeah. Yeah, I'm thinking max, max guard, guard Flare Blitz. Mm hmm. Watch him target it for a second. I was going to say for a second, I thought that was his Togekiss. Oh. <laughs> Alright, hopefully he targeted into a Togekiss right here. It's his best play, anyways. Yeah, there it is. Alright, so we get the, uh, we get the Whimsy Cop. What, what throws me off is, like, the first crit with Togekiss could just be blind luck. For all we know, that isn't crit kiss. Yeah, but... Yeah, it's the second and the third crit where you're like, okay, it's crit kiss. <laughs> I don't know, man. I think it's crit kiss no matter what. Oh, yeah, what. no. Like, it's, it's safe to assume considering how common it is. Like, we're running it, man. But, like, I'm always still scared of it. Who would we even switch out into? Pharaoh, right? Yeah, definitely. Yeah, because he wouldn't have he wouldn't max flare on this last turn. Ooh, never mind, not Pharaoh. Yeesh, he's got his own incinerator. I don't like it. Maybe so we take an airstream. Our best play might just be to airstream and switch out, like into Manectric or something. You think so? I'm thinking. Well, no, we need to preserve Sash and Manectric. I'm gonna. I'm just gonna double into this thing, man. I'm You're doubling into Togekiss. Sacrifice Incineroar. Yeah. Like if if some if by some miracle we we take a non-crit airstream, then we should do a lot of damage this way. That's a fifty percent roll. I'm scared. It was a fifty percent roll for him to get the crit in the first place. <laughs> nah, man. That was oh he just he knew like he he clicked the button and he knew he was gonna get the crit. Yeah, crit because players are something else. They just know. That is... I'm going to say that's not a crit. It went way too slow. No, it's a crit. <laughs> oh my gosh. Chris, go. I just... It's only fun when we use it. If someone else is using it, it's not fun. That's the rule. Guys that are listening, just don't use things that we want to use. Yeah, okay? just, if just you let us have kiss, fun. Yes, exactly. Don't do those things. It's not a lot. We're banning it, dude. 
I'm banning you guys from my Twitch chat. <laughs> from my Twitch chat, if you try to use Crit Kiss. <laughs> using Crit Kiss when I'm using Crit Kiss, banned. Yeah. All right, so now, here's the issue. Um, both of his Pokemon are faster than Manectric, probably. Yeah. If by some miracle the Crit Kiss isn't faster than Manectric, if it's like zero speed investment, I'm pretty sure it's still faster. You know what faster. I think you should have done? I think what? you should have went on the Ferrothorn, force him to target Ferrothorn, but go for Protect on Ferrothorn, and then swap out Incineroar for Manectric. That way, Incineroar can come back out, get the Intimidate off, and the Fake out. That's true. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try this. I'm just gonna try to Parting Shot that Incineroar and go for a Volt Switch here. We should be faster than Incineroar, right? He's only a plus one. I don't. And I doubt we're faster than Incineroar speed. for sure. We're probably not faster than Togekiss. But we get a free Volt Switch. Gee, buzz. Yikes. Okay. That's so much. He got double crit, dude. Are He's you serious? He's only crit this game. <laughs> I, I just. Can I? Can we dedox him? Is that allowed in Pokemon? Play Pokemon? Can we oh, he is him? fast, dude. Bro, he's definitely running max speed, max attack. He's a bad player. No, we're not going to call him a bad player yet. He's a bad player. I mean, we lost, man. I don't like this guy. All right, but the Incineroar is at minus one now. You know what the only issue is? We're not running body press. We're not, and he's still <laughs> going to kill us. I don't like this guy. We got this. We got it. We're going to grab one more. One more. We're not going down on this now. I need a, I need a Kingler win. I need yeah. a Kingler win for the game. Like Kingler's been a major team player. It just hasn't won yet. All right. Why did he have to get three crit? And it, it's he got. I told you. He knows what he's doing. 100% crit every time. Yeah. Can we talk about how all the damage we've taken on the final turn of the last game and every turn of this game has been crit damage? That's got to be a fan. record. That's got to be a record for dam for like m m the most amount of critical hits in two games. I'm just not a fan. Yeah. <laughs> Can, you know what I wish? Because I, I used to do this all the time and uh, I still do it in Smash Bros. If I come across somebody that lags, I ban them or I block them. I literally mid match home button, friend friend list or whatever, and then I block them. Yeah, because I, I can't wish match I could them. do that in Pokemon, but I can't. <laughs> Just block everyone that you can't beat. <laughs> yeah, no, block. Or I, I would block bad players. I block players that do things that I don't approve of, i.e., cheat. Because I didn't win, obviously. Mm -hmm. uh, and I would, <laughs> if, I would just block them, you know? Or something that I just that pisses me off. I didn't like, win. Kiss? Yeah, I didn't yeah. win, so all of you are cheaters. Bro, we're, blocked we're, instantly. We're taking the Verlus route now. Absolutely, man. That's my hero right there. <laughs> <laughs> Please understand that I'm being sarcastic. Oh, I don't yeah. want anyone coming at me being like, you like Verlus? Oh, my God. Moxie, how dare you support somebody that supports Verlus? Hold up, You're we just, losing a sub. Dude, we just found the, the Manectric gold mine. Ooh. Name one thing on this team that Manectric doesn't mess up. We Volt Switch on the Mimikyu, we break the we break the disguise every time. We threaten... Dragapult, maybe? What was it? Drag, I mean, Dragapult, Drag it could be special Dragapult, and we still Eerie Impulse that thing. I think that's physical, looking at his team. Dude, you I'm know, gonna... Honestly, he's got three and three. It could be special. It could be special. Bro, it's it's freaking Kingler time. <laughs> yes. Yeah, I, I don't even I don't even need to double I don't need to double check this one. I already know I'm bringing the squad. You Kingler, Manectric, Incineroar, Ferrothorn. The first four in the team. Prime Pokemon right now. Yes. The only thing we have to be Power. careful about is Overdrive. Overdrive could mess us up, but we could always just eerie impulse it, and then he's not doing any kinds of damage. Yeah, and I think we can, we can definitely live in overdrive, especially if we Dynamax. Oh, yeah. Like, we now can take one is, overdrive. Do you think that's Gigantamax, Toxtricity, and Gigantamax, Lapras? If it's Gigantamax, Toxtricity, do. that makes this way easier. I would run Gigantamax, Toxtricity. Because Max Stun Shock is the best move that thing gets, and that's single target. See, if he was smart like me, he would overdrive first. Yeah. Get the Throat Spray, and then G Max Stun Shock. Oh yeah, it's gamer time. Bro, he's gonna get he's gonna get eight up. He's he's ooh, is he gonna Dynamax? Halusha? Ooh, he's mold breaker, so what does that what does that help what does that help him with? <laughs> I don't know, but he's not Dynamaxing Halucha. Yeah, I'm gonna foam burst Halucha right now because nothing switches in on that, and I'm gonna eerie impulse the hell out of this thing. 
and the Lapras. Didn't we talk about this? In a, <laughs> yeah. We talked about this before. The only way, the way to beat Lapras, people that are so afraid of Gigantamax Lapras, because uh, I have somebody in my Discord, and he's he's actually it's like, oh, man, I'm not playing Mons anymore until the next series. And I'm like, why? He's like, I can't beat Gigantamax Lapras. And I'm like, what's the problem? I just can't beat it. It's too bulky. I'm like, stop fighting it. Just ignore it. Yeah, just leave but it alone. Just lower its defenses or whatever. You know, just keep knocking the stats down and you're good. Oh, here he goes. He thinks he's going to do damage. That's definitely Lapras. And he's going to set up screens while we have Brick Break after Dynamax. Dude, oh. this is going to be... I feel like we're going to oh. rob this man of this game. And... Uh, you know, if we don't win this match, I'm gonna feel so stupid. But also, <laughs> I feel like we're gonna. If we rob don't this. win the match, just just DC and delete the recording, bro. Exactly. No one has dude, to this, know. this game never happened. <laughs> close combat, never bro. Close combat. Hello. All right. Why thank would you. you do that? He just, oh, he's white herb. He's got to be white herb. Show me the no, white herb. You're still going he's down. Not. He. Yeah. Oh, he's, he's a not life white orb, herb. bro. Dude, why would you do that? Maybe he's gonna target Manetric. I mean, even if he targets at Manectric here, I'm, I'm still confident we just won. <laughs> we did, but I just, I don't understand why he would do that. All right, thanks for the Halucha, dude. Maybe that's all he thought he could do. I don't... Doesn't that I, thing get U-turn? I, I would have switched or something. All right, Max Resonance. That's probably a Manectric. All right, that's Yo. fine. Manectric did its job. He, he did his job, man. Yeah, that Labyrinth ain't doing nothing. We just have to and not just touch leave it with alone because we don't have yeah we don't activate the weakness policy we're just gonna leave it alone. We'll just break break the partner. <laughs> All right, uh, I'm gonna send in Ferrothorn. I feel safe with Ferrothorn. Oh wait 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 up oh, never mind. Oh too late. I was gonna say you should throw out Incineroar so you get the Timid off of whatever he's gonna throw out and then parting shot the Lapras so it's at minus three. Then you go into Ferrothorn knowing he's gonna go for the Incineroar. Well my thought process was type. leading Incineroar initially and then I was just concerned that he would be faster because <laughs> i wanted a parting shot out but i have seen some faster lapras he's not faster he's at minus two. Oh, you're dude i'm stupid <laughs> all right here i'm gonna max quake i'll make it up to you i'll max quake and i'll gyro ball okay okay Except i'm max quaking right here because like freaking ferrothorn with special defense game's over yes the game's just over yes what Taunt. did you think <laughs> i was gonna do man probably lead seed because I, yeah. I would have told you to lead seed if we didn't have Gyro. True. He's going to cry. This is a Kingler game. This is what we needed. This is the great way to end the video. This is what we needed right here. Yeah. And before this man has Kingler. freaking... He's going to have sheer cold and just nae, nae on us. Yo, <laughs> relax. Because I got hit with that and I was pissed. I was so <laughs> mad. I literally... did. I closed the game. I've run that before. I felt dirty. I, got, I, I hate it. Because it, it just... It happens and I cry. Hold up. But Berry Berry... No, that's oh, no, Keyberry. Key berry. All right, he's still gonna do like two damage. Why is he resident? <laughs> oh, I'm, hey man, Lapras, do what you want, bro. Do what you want, Lapras. Die. All right, here's the thing: a hundred percent, a hundred percent. He has to Willow Wisp this Ferrothorn, so we're gonna protect. Do you think he has Willow? Oh, he's got Taunt. He probably has Willow or Trick. No, 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 no. Oh no, he's got Trick Room. Yeah, he doesn't have Willow because yeah, he would trick have to room, have Trick Room, Taunt, some Ghost Move. Yeah, play we're good. Rough. We're good. Uh, no, I'm no, a Jarrah no, again. Oh wait, we can't. We can't even. Uh, we can't even protect. We're taunted. Oh, you're right. You're right. I'm just gonna Jarrah ball. Cause I don't want to power whip. I don't wanna give yeah. him weakness policy. I want to just I deny him anything that Lapras. Lapras wants to do. I just want to leash the Lapras and just make him make him cry. And then we get and then we get sheer colded and then we cry. No, stop! Stop <laughs> speaking that into existence. Is he gonna get the attack drop? No, he can't. We're we're a uh, hypercutter. Oh, that's right. I thought it only worked for intimidate, but that's nice. Nah, it's everything. You just can't get oh. your attack drops. I mean, except for Willow Wisp, but that's like that just bypasses everything. Mm -hmm. well, we need that. hypercutter and guts in one ability. Watch, he's gonna do two. He better do two, man. Basically, he's <laughs> at minus four. This is beautiful. He he's pressed right now, and he just made it so we can't get put to sleep. Oh, we still have Manetric. Oh my goodness. All right, give me that thing. I'm going to break break just to let him know there was never even a chance. <laughs> yes, take his screens. There was never a chance, bud. <laughs> take his screens. He does not need them any longer. Yeah, dude, the truth is the game was rigged from the start. Big facts. He never saw it coming. I feel like he's going to keep playing because he thinks he has a chance. Don't be Dragapult, please, because I want to break break on something that isn't this thing. 
Oh, okay. Ooh. We still don't lose. Once we get our freaking... Yeah, once we get our thing back, we, we just win. Well, no, we should be faster, right? We should be faster than a... Than Tox? Uh, maybe not. If he's max speed, I think... But we're at, like, plus a mil... We're at plus three, effectively. Do you think we can take... I mean, plus two, because the, the stuff on the field. I think we can take it with the Assault Vest. So I think you should break, break on Tox. I'm not even going to bother, because we still beat... We still beat this entire team. Because what do we have in the well, back? Well, because we have... he has the screens up, so high horsepower probably won't kill Tox. Yeah, well, no, high horsepower is definitely killing Tox. You I don't so? even care about the screens, to be honest. We beat Tox regardless as soon as we get our as soon as soon we get our thing back. Because we're at plus one special defense. I'm just going to gyro ball into Tox, and then I'll leech seed to win. I'm not even I'm not even concerned, man. Yeah, we're faster. Dang. Give me that. Double dang through screens. I hate this is why I don't like Tox. I love Tox and I hate him. This man. Oh, no. <laughs> I told you he not to into existence and you did it anyway. <laughs> you did it anyway. He's got the move. Now, right. you're, now you're forced to protect and brick break him just to show just just to assert dominance. Brick break him in his face. Yeah, just to assert dominance. All right. That tells me he's probably not weakness policy. If you've got sheer cold. And even if he does, I think we still win. I hate him. I, I don't I like him, him too much. I, I'm not a fan. Give me your screens. No more screens. That did like way too much. Yes. Oh, he is weakness policy. Too bad he dies next turn. Doesn't matter, bro. We're at plus 99. He's not. Go for sheer code. I dare you. Yes. Got him. Yes. Power whip his life away. Brick break time. You're dead. I'm sending an incineroar just just for the final <laughs> intimidate for the meme. And here's the thing: if he lives on like one somehow, I would I would have faked out. That'd be the ultimate insult. <laughs> GG no re. All right, we did it. We got the most satisfying Kingler game possible. Yes, that was that was a great Kingler dominant game right there. I'm, I'm a going fan with the clutch. I'm a fan of this team. I like it a lot. I, th I think this team is solid. Oh hell yeah! As far as for series three, I can definitely see it competing with a couple of a couple of oh. The current meta I see it competing with, especially since everyone is figuring out that party shot is disgusting. Yep. And so a G Max Hattering and other things, well, anything with magic bounce, but speak specific, specifically G Max Hattering, yeah. party shot it, and it, it just goes away. It's, just it's forces beautiful. it back out. Yes. But yeah, I guess uh, that's going to be it for today. Thank you so much for watching the video. Be sure to check out Yoku's channel, which will be linked in the description. I'm also going to put in a card at the end of the video of the team building process. If for some reason you ignored me and decided to watch this video first, uh, you can go ahead and watch us build that team on his channel. Uh, and also, here's the code on screen if you guys want it. Thank you so much for supporting both of us uh, right now with everything that's been going on. We really appreciate all of you. Do you have anything you want to say? Uh... No, use this team. Have fun with it. Uh, definitely. De you know what? Actually, send us your records. I, I just want to see people win. Yeah, I want to see the most disgusting thing you can do with G Max Kingler. Clip it from your Switch or your Elgato, whatever, and send it to one of us. I just want to see the, the Kingler disgust. Can we just start that? No yeah, more Togekiss. I, I don't want that. Give me your Kingler <laughs> disgusting plays. That's what I want to see. That's exactly what we want, man. But yeah, that's going to be it, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate all of you. Uh, you should leave a like, subscribe for Pokemon content, and we'll see you in the next video. Bye. Smell you later.